We are gathered here to ask for simple fairness from our Republican colleagues. We just want our constituents to have the dignity to have their elected representative cast their vote on gun safety legislation. That's how our democracy works from the founding of America to the present day. The American people debate the great issues of the time. Their elected officials cast votes on those issues. The American public has a right to know where their member of Congress stands on gun violence. And we are tired of doing moments of silence and thoughts and prayers for every mass shooting. Since Newtown, there's been over 1,100 mass shootings of four people or more. Every day, 297 people are shot in America. That means the next five minutes, someone in America will be shot. Who will that be? Will it be someone you know, an acquaintance or a loved one? Will it be a child playing outside or someone dancing in a night? Now, I am not unaware that different members have different districts, and some of our Republican colleagues have hard districts and hard lives. They've got to, you know, deal with extremists in their constituencies. They have to raise money from the NRA. They have to stand for re-election. And to those people, I say, our thoughts and prayers are with you.